guys, so welcome back to my channel. Yeah, as you can tell, I am wearing something brand new. Usually, you guys will find me in my NYX Butter Gloss in Tiramisu. However, I'm trying to branch out. And this one is the Stila Stay All Day. Stay All Day? Stay All Day Liquid Lipstick in Amore or Amor number no. 9. Um, yeah, I have just been falling in love with all of the dark colors that I've been seeing everybody wear on Instagram, and I really just wanted to venture out and step out of my comfort zone and just really try some new stuff. And I don't know, I'm... Because I have full lips, I've always been afraid to wear color. But because I just don't want it to be like, oh, hello, here are my lips. Let me know what you guys think um, in the comment box below. I would really, truly appreciate any help that you can give me or any criticism and any feedback on this uh, lipstick. Another reason that I have decided to venture out is because I ordered some stuff from Colourpop. I received an eyeshadow in my Ipsy bag a couple of months ago and absolutely fell in love with the formula. It is so creamy and blends so well that I decided why not? Let's get some stuff. Let's see what came in my bag. So it gives you a little card. It's tips and tricks on how to use your Super Shock shadow. A book comes in here tips and tricks again on everything that they have so on the shadow on the cheeks on the gel cream on the lipsticks on the pencils on the ultra matte lips it gives you tips and tricks right here and you also get a thank you card mine just simply says hey Christina you're the Obi-Wan for me XOXO Colourpop how did they know I was a Star Wars freak First eyeshadow that I have, this is the color right here. We're going to go with Degef and let's do a little swirl. Oh, that is so velvety. My God, I'm not even pushing hard, guys. Oh, that is so beautiful. This is the second eyeshadow that I have. This one is Cheap Date and... One of the reasons I did decide to try to get this one, or I did get this one, was because Luster Lux Katie has always been raving about this shadow. And oh my god, now I see why. Oh my god, look at that. That is gorgeous. I actually love those colors together. This is the third eyeshadow that I got. This one is Party Time. I really. You know, when I ordered it, I thought it was going to be different, but I'm actually loving the color. I can't even tell you what this formula feels like. It is just, ooh, nice. It is just so velvety and so spongy. Is that a word? So this is the one that I received in my Ipsy bag. As you can tell, I have used it. A little bit does go a long way. I just wanted to check something with you guys. Okay, so this one right here, this is stereo. These are the four colors that I have. These three I did purchase. This one came in my Ipsy bag. Seriously, guys, this is with no primer on the back of my hand. Nothing, just a simple swatch. Gorgeous. Look at that pigment. That's... I love it. I love it. I cannot wait to swatch the rest of the stuff. The next thing that I ordered from ColourPop was some shimmer, which is the Super 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 Super, super Shock. Oh my God, Super Shock Cheek. Um, for my highlight, I'm usually wearing Benefit What's Up, or I am still using my NARS in, oh lord, how are you going to tell me, Alabastros? Let's go with that one. But 
Again, I heard Lester Lux Katie rave about this one and I had to buy it. Why not? So here is the shimmer that I got. This is Electric Slide Super Shock Cheek and this is actually pearlized. So, oh, this feels so velvety. I don't want to stop touching it. Love it. Love, love, love. So yeah, this formula is extremely creamy. I cannot get over how creamy their formulas are. I really can't. They're amazing. I, I, I love how they feel. They glide on and glide right off too. On to the next gorgeous things that I purchased, which are the Alipis. Here are all the lippies that I purchased. I got six of them. Um, not gonna lie, some of them are probably about the same shade, but I don't care. I wanted lippies and I got lippies and I'm going to order more lippies because So here is the first one. This is called Teeny Tiny. They have such cute names for these too. Here is this color right here. It's more of a, it looks like a mauve color. Yeah, this is more of a mauve color. Here is Teeny Tiny close up. It is really pretty. It's that color right there. It's dark. It's a lot darker than what it looks like in the tube, but I, I actually like this one a lot. This is the next one. This is more of a fuchsia magenta color, and this is called Mo Better. Not Mo, but more better. But in my family, we say Mo Better. Here is more better close up. That is really pretty fuchsia color. I'm frightened but excited at the same time. That's really pretty. The camera does not do it justice. Next color that I'm going to swatch for you guys is Tool. This is more of a... I'm not good at describing <laughs> colors but I don't know. It's more of like a brick color. Here's tool close up. See how it's a very, I don't know, it's brown and orange. Here's this one right here. This one is tool. Next one that I'm going to be swatching is limbo. Uh, they actually say this is a dupe for one of the Kylie Jenner um, lipsticks. Here is a limbo close up. It's not a true brown. Wow. Not gonna lie, the reason I bought this is because of the name. It's called Creeper. <laughs> but it is a red lippy. Uh, yeah, this is very out of my comfort zone. Very out of my comfort zone. So I can't wait to really try this on, but. Hopefully the swatch looks gorgeous. As you can tell, it's more of an orangey red. It's not a true red. This one is Creeper. I don't know what y'all think. I'm not very good at doing the swatches, am I, guys? Last one that I have for you guys is Silhouette. This is more of a dark red color. Silhouette that is gorgeous seriously i'm not good at doing these swatches <laughs> so here are the colors again i am not good at swatching but these are them i promise i will put a better picture of these swatches on instagram because 
This does not do them any kind of justice. But even as they dry, oh my god, the formula feels so good. It feels so smooth. It doesn't feel harsh on my on my skin. Usually when I've um, swatched other ones, just you know, for me, I could feel kind of them getting a little crusty, if that makes any kind of sense. But yeah, I can feel them getting a little crusty. These don't feel that way at all. These feel very smooth very very smooth and it dries quickly there's really no smearing i will try one of them out all day um and do a review and see how it holds up and let you guys know i'm so glad that i shared this haul with you guys if you guys didn't know about ColourPop, now you do one thing that i do love about this is that they are extremely affordable with that being said, if you have anything that you would like for me to review or if you have any video suggestions, please leave me a comment down below or on any of my other pages. If you did like this video, please remember to thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel and you'd like to, click that little button down below. Also remember that I do have a blog, ChrissyEsparza.com. I also have a Instagram, Twitter, Pinterest, Snapchat, and Facebook. All those links can be found down below in my description box. Again, thank you so much for visiting my channel. Te amo. Bye.